Hey guys, so I'm here today with a video that I've been wanting to do all year long, but I just kept putting it off, and so now I'm going to do it. It is another designer shoe haul, and I have two shirts also to show you guys. So um, I started collecting designer shoes probably like two years ago. So I, I think I have one other video where I show you guys some shoes, and um, I've just basically been building my collection slowly. Um, since I have so many shoes from like Shoe Dazzle and Just Fab and Lulu's and all these other places, I was like, why don't I have any, you know, designer shoes that are going to last me a long time? So um, either when I see them on sale or when it's a holiday or my birthday or something like that, I'll try to find something that I want that's going to complement my wardrobe and also last. And I wanted to show you guys the items that I picked up. So I'm going to start with the uh, fanciest shoes and these are um, my second pair of Manolo Blahnik Hangeese's and I got these for such a good deal like it's ridiculous my first ones I believe um, they were full price but these um, Nordstrom they never put like these shoes on sale not these and for some odd reason last year right before Christmas they had a either a 15% off coupon or 20%. So these normally are like a thousand dollars. I wound up getting them for like seven, like 780 or something like that, which is insane. And right here on the front, this is a um, Swarovski crystal pendant. This shines so beautifully when it, the light hits it. It's absolutely gorgeous. And um, I wanted these in purple. They had the purple ones couple years ago and um, they don't have them now so another color that I wear quite often is this peach color I have a lot of items in my wardrobe that is this color and I wanted to get something that I could put with a lot of outfits not just have it sitting on my shelf and just be like oh my gosh shoes so these shoes are a hundred percent leather the upper is leather the back is leather and um, this the material here is like a satin these I would not wear if it was raining like it, it rains a lot down here so no I would not wear these if I was if it was raining um, in general if I'm going out to dinner I will wear these like on a dinner date um, where we live we have covered parking and a lot of times where we go to dinner <laughs> even to the mall over here like the cover the parking is always covered so like I can get away with wearing them when it's raining because I'm not actually outside but other than that um, I would not wear these in certain conditions as far as the fit I did get the um, I'm a size 8 normally so I got the 38 and a half and these actually like I have the blue ones also these actually pinch a little tighter in the front than the blue ones so I wore these when I went to Orlando in March and just like a short walk in the hotel they were pinching my feet and they were hurting so bad and it just really shocked me because the blue ones were not that uncomfortable but this is how these look and the heel is not very high these are classic pumps that I just absolutely love so next this is a heel that actually came out also around Christmas time. This is the Jimmy Choo Rami. I also have the Jimmy Choo Ables and I heard that they're not going to be making the Able heels anymore and that this is going to be the one that replaces it. It looks exactly like the Able pump. Um, this particular like design, it's almost like gold glitter and it's like kind of scaly, it's textured. And I believe the color that I got was champagne. I really um, like these heels just because of the design and the way that they look. The thing that I thought was really cool that they were advertising around Christmas is that you can get these engraved on the back and with gold letters, like whatever you want it to say. So like these were a Christmas gift for my husband and I wanted to get like I love you on the back. I just haven't been down to Nordstrom to ask them to do it for me. But this is how it looks. It's leather on both sides. And um, this is a 38 and a half. These are really, really comfortable. All of the Jimmy Choo, the Ables, and these are very comfortable. You can walk in them. 
they're not gonna like hurt your feet and you know anything like that but that's how these look right here and these do come in silver I think and one other color I don't even know if they have this color exactly anymore but it was champagne next I have these and these are Burberry sandals they're listed as sandals I would just call them wedges and I got these um, to go with my Burberry t-shirts and I usually I don't know I don't really care for like buying wedges but they didn't Burberry doesn't have a whole lot of stuff that I like um, as far as like clothes and shoes goes or I like a lot of their bags but they don't really have a whole lot that I like and so I just wanted one simple shoe that I can wear with any of my shirts if I'm going out usually this is something that I wear when I'm going cruising or on vacation like to a resort or something like that and um, I love the the way that the plaid is like on the heel and it, the plaid is different all the way around so it's the same on one side and then it's the same on this side so I thought that was pretty cool these are leather I got them in a size 38 and they fit true to size these are very very comfortable and I'm going to show you guys the shirts that I got to go with those so this is the shirt this is just a plain t-shirt and it has like the little Burberry check on the sleeves here and it's just it's a simple shirt but it's simple and that's that's why I like it and um, my husband wears Burberry also so if I want to do like a husband and wife kind of matching look it's easy for me to just put on my shirt put on my heels and he puts on his shirt and then we match so I have it in black I've shown you guys the red one before but I have it in white and this isn't like regular t-shirt like it looks like a t-shirt but the material it's um it's got spandex in it so it's stretchy so it's not like just a regular t-shirt because I was worried that it would feel just like you're wearing a t-shirt and it's like why would you pay that much for you know something that was just a t-shirt but it has a very nice feel to it it's form-fitting and um, it's one of it's one of my favorite items that they sell like clothing wise um, in the future like one of the things that I really want to get is like a leather or not leather well for my husband he liked the leather jacket but I would I would like the leather why I keep saying leather the trench coat and um, maybe like a bag or a wallet or something like that we'll see where I go building up my Burberry collection but that is um, the extent of the stuff that I have as Burberry at the moment then I have these these are Alexander Wang and this shoe is called Kindle I got this shoe for a really good deal it was on sale these are leather um, the inside is leather the bottom is leather also these are a size 38 I got these online from Nordstrom these were like $600 and they got marked down to like 200 and I love booties especially for fall and winter but I mean like the way that these are designed I could I would wear these in the summer also like I would wear these year-round so I love the zipper detail I had a pair of booties like this from just fab so around the time that I bought these like that was like really popular and um so yeah this is a really comfortable shoe and it goes with a lot of stuff very stylish I, I really like it and like the thing that I just always tell people is like if you really want to build like a designer shoe collection just like check the sales like check like see what goes on sale so the last shoe that I have is another one that I waited for it to go on sale this is kind of like a rambunctious type heel um, I was on the fence about buying it because of all these colors that's on it but this is Sophia Webster and these are a 38 and a half um, leather on the bottom leather on the inside this is uh, it's a wedge <laughs> it's really it makes your foot look really small like to me this does not look like a 38 and a half this looks like a size 6 or something like that but this heel was like $650 and I saw that it was on sale but I kept waiting and then it sold out and I guess like they, they had maybe one or two more in their inventory 
and I was like, man, I should have I should have bought that shoe when I was looking at it. So then when I saw that they got like a few more, I ordered it. And um, it's just a unique heel, and you can wear a lot of different things with it because of all the colors. And you know the polka dots, like you can do, you can do a lot with it, and it's comfortable. The only thing that I don't like about this, this strap up here, it's very short. So to me, the heel is not. The heel is comfortable, but the strap is not comfortable. The strap is kind of tight on my ankle because it just. It's hard to adjust and then you don't have a lot of leeway because it it like wraps around you'll see you know in the side by side but those are my designer items that I've been waiting to show you guys these shoes and um, I'll probably be back maybe late fall going into winter with another one because I have some boots that are really cute that I won't show you guys but for now this is like what I have and um, if you guys have any questions, just like leave me a comment and I'll get back to you. And I hope that you guys have a great afternoon.